hey angels welcome back to my channel so today's video is kind of going to be like a little vlog style type thing um i had a wholesale order to do a body shimmer oil wholesale order so i just thought i would record, would record the process so first we're gonna start by being sanitary and stuff like that like all of my areas is clean my hand was washed and alcohol was sprayed on it and now we're just gonna add our gloves gloves so to start we're gonna use apricot kernel oil grapeseed oil and then we're also gonna use our vitamin e oil which is our jason vitamin e oil if you guys been here for a while this type of uh, vitamin e oil does contain different types of oil in there also we're going to be using our preservative preservative cap too because this is a oil based product and then we're going to use our micas both of our micas are from tkb trading um the first one is apricot uh this one is apricot mica and then the other one is golden flake something like that <laughs> i forgot <laughs> so you're also gonna need something to fill in the bottles in this case i'm using my syringe you're gonna need a spatula as well as your bowl i'm using a glass bowl that i got from my local store and our bottles these are our two ounce dropper bottles so let's get started oh by the way you're also gonna need paper towels for when you mess up <laughs> <laughs> so let's get started quick little disclaimer we are not measuring here so i'm just gonna pour in the rest of my apricot kernel oil i am i run out so i just put it in order for more anyways so we're gonna pour that in and then we're gonna pour in some of our grapeseed oil which we also ran out of so i put in order for that one as well but i'm going to my uh, local store really quick to get some because i do need to finish a lot of orders today so we're just gonna pour that in so throughout this entire video everything just went wrong i ran out of every single oil that i had to use i'm out of grapeseed oil apricot kernel oil uh, right now we're gonna be adding a couple drops of my vitamin e oil which i ran out of during this video as well and then after that we're gonna add our preservative cap too which i'm almost out of too so you know what a lot of things went wrong during that video i broke one of my dropper bottles at one point i just wanted to give up but i continued to do it and anyway, so at this point in this clip i got up to go get my fragrance and then my foot hit the table and everything just tumbled and some of our bottles <laughs> went straight into the floor after cleaning everything up <laughs> we're gonna be using our love spell fragrance i got this from amazon and we're just gonna add about 12 to 15 drops i believe <laughs> of that uh, fragrance and then get a move on Once all of our oils, preservative, uh, preservative as well as our fragrance is added in, we're just gonna mix everything together to make sure it is well incorporated. There's just something so satisfying to me about mixing all of those oils together. And bruh, that thing smells so good. <laughs> so after doing that, it is time to add our pigment. So I'm gonna start with my first pigment and add about two spoons worth of that pigment. It, this pigment is more of kind of like a blue blush a gold um uh rose gold i don't know like how to describe this color but it's more it's more of a blush golden type of shade and then next we're gonna take our actual golden pigment and we're gonna add a pretty damn good amount of that now adding our second pigment i'm going to add two big full spoon worth of that golden pigment and then we're just gonna give that a quick mix and wait until you guys see that mix it just looks so satisfying to me i don't know it's, i don't know if it's satisfying to you but it looks satisfying to me so we're just gonna mix that until everything is incorporated So going back, we're going to add a little bit more of that golden pigment as well as the blush golden pigment that I was meant talking about earlier. That The one I did not know how to describe. We're going to add a bit of that and then we're going to mix everything together. Using my favorite tool out of this entire world, which is my hand mixer, we're going to mix everything to get rid of the chunks of pigment that stayed at the bottom of the bowl. And this will create a bit of air bubble, but just after you're done mixing it with that, just use your spoon, your spoon spatula, whatever it is that you're using, and just go and mix it with this. So we're just going to get rid of all of the pigment chunks. Once 
once you're done mixing everything together with whether it's by hand spatula mixer whatever this is how it's gonna look like so now we're gonna fill up our syringe to the top and then we're gonna fill in the dropper bottles so i know all of our social media you guys see the perfect in the perfect video clip of people filling in bottles suits and stuff like that but honestly it's not always like that so right now check out this quick little fail of us trying to fill in our very first dropper bottle so we got it all the way working until at the top so be careful when using the syringe until at the top the syringe had a lot of air in it and then it brought everything on the table <laughs> then right here we failed <laughs> like i said you sometimes mistakes happen learning from our mistake we did better filling the rest of the bottles so this one is actually very satisfying and we filled it up we make sure that the oil reached the top where there was no bubbles inside of the syringe itself so look how pretty this body shimmer is oh lord jesus it's gorgeous Once we finish filling up all of our um, dropper bottles, I'm going to take a little bit of napkin and add some um, alcohol on it and then just wipe the tip of the bottle because I don't want excess oils to get in there. And then we're going to take our white dropper bottles and then we're just going to screw them in and we're going to do that for the rest of them. Once we're done right wiping the tip of it all, we're going to screw the droppers on. Make sure that it is screwed on tight because you don't want it to like something happens during transit or anything like that. So we're just going to do it for all of the bottles. And this is stunning. So I'm going to show you guys how it looks once everything is done. But thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you were able to enjoy this video and don't forget to like comment and subscribe as well as turn on that post notification bell on to be notified whenever I post a video I'll see you guys next time bye